Hello everyone and welcome back or to my ASMR channel. Um, today we are going to be going over everything I got for the Bath and Body Works semi-annual day sale. Now I know my makeup looks a little bit busted and my hands are covered in paint. Um, I've been busy today. Also, I apologize for any pauses or cuts. I have both my cat and my dog in my room with me. And I'm filming in the front of my house, not the back of my house, which the front of the house faces the parking lot. So, there might be some more cuts in this video than usual. But anyways, so Bath and Body Works twice a year has their semi-annual day sale, and it's not a day. It lasts for, I think, a few weeks. Um, basically, it's, um... It always is like the day after Christmas for the winter and then they have one in the summer um, and they do this so that way they can clear out their old inventory and bring in some new stuff. So I usually get like a few things like a few body washes and stuff like that from the semi-annual day sale but this year I went kind of feral. Um, I, um, I've been going to Bath and Body Works a lot or buying online. I had a person go to me go for me to two different Bath and Body Works and then I ordered a whole bunch of stuff online and usually with Bath and Body Works my stuff is like shipped quickly but um I guess because it's coming from different warehouses it took longer than it usually did um and I was like missing some things and I had to contact customer service but anyways it all got here it's all good by the way their customer service was great um I just think so many people were ordering at one time like the tracking numbers got a little bit confused Okay, so uh, let's get in and start. I don't remember what I exactly I bought online versus what I bought in store. Um, so let's get started. Let's start with the candles. Now, I, during the winter, I bought a lot of candles um, for their candle day sale, where the candles were like, I think, $10.50, $10.95, something like that. I bought a lot of like gourmand, like food scented candles and I wanted to get uh, something differently so I really focused on like clean smelling scents basically just non-food related and that goes, uh, that's pretty much true for the body care and the candles um, I think I did get a few things that are um, food scented I wish I had some coffee beans so I can like clear my nose in between these sticks but we'll just go ahead and we'll try to get through it, okay? so one of the first candles, by the way, they always come in like these boxes one of the candles that I got is a classic favorite of mine, and I think they have the scent year-round, but I'm not sure. Um, but it was on sale, and it is Champagne Toast. It has really pretty packaging. Um, this has notes of bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, juicy tangerine. And it, it's like, you definitely get the berries. It smells almost like a pink lemonade if you like took out the lemon or like not as strong as lemon kind of a bubblegummy scent but not like too bubblegummy it's definitely like it's like a more mature fruity scent but it's one of my favorite candles and um i was completely out i had like three but they were all down to like that so i got um, a new one and like i said the packaging is really pretty Next candle, once again, in one of these boxes. This one is Fresh Fall Morning. And really pretty packaging. Um, it says it has citrus zest, woodland sage, and red delicious apples as its notes. It smells it smells kind of like Irish Spring mixed with, um, what's that other one called? I can't think of it. Old Spice, Old Spice. But it smells like that. It's definitely like a manly scent. Like this is what a man smells like. But I can imagine that it's pretty powerful. But it is like a clean smell, not a dirty man. Um, it is a nice clean smell and I look forward to burning it. This would be like a good scent if like a man in your life liked candles or you want to get him into candles. It's kind of like a sexy scent too, but it reminds me of Irish Spring. So, it depends on if you like those type of scents or not. 
Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Okay. So the next scent I have is Sweater Weather. Now I had heard about this um, from several uh, Bath and Body Works YouTubers and just like other YouTubers in general bringing it up, but I had never smelled it before. So I figured I would go ahead and give it a try. Um, it's once again really pretty packaging and like this packaging is just like general winter. It's not Christmas and where I live winter lasts until March. Um, it's supposed to snow three to six inches tomorrow, so that'll be fun. I hate the snow. Um, this is once again like a manly scent. Um, it has fresh sage, juniper berry, um, aromatic eucalyptus and fresh wood. I definitely am getting the sage. It does smell really strongly of sage. But it's like a clean sage. So it's not like, it's not like if you burnt sage it smells like. It smells like if you had laundry detergent that had sh uh, sage in it. Is how I could describe it. Okay, by the way, my hair, my hair, my hair, my hair is crazy and so is my makeup. But I wanted to get this video out. Um, so I, I had some technical difficulties with the video I was trying to upload yesterday. So hopefully this goes smoother and hopefully I can get both videos up soon. Okay, the last candle I got is called Crisp Morning Air. And it is crisp fall breeze, white oak, golden amber wood, saffron, soft and soft sandalwood. Now, I already sniffed this one and I really, really love it. Uh, it just, it smells like a fall morning and like soap. It just smells so good and the packaging is really pretty. And once again, it's not like a winter packaging, like you can, you know, put this out. And even though it's crisp morning air, I think it could work all year round, but I would especially burn this candle in the fall. It just smells so nice. It smells so nice. I love it. Okay. Alright. Now, this is where the bulk of my haul is. And that is in the body here. I am going to do this in no specific order. I am just going to do it in the way things are placed to the side of me. So, one of the scents I have is definitely a Christmas scent, but it's one of my favorite scents. Um, it could work all year round, but I kind of identify it as a winter scent, and that is Winter Candy Apple. Now, Winter Candy Apple has notes of candy red apple, winter rose petals, candied orange, maple leaf, and fresh cinnamon. See, they say it has cinnamon in it but it never smells like cinnamon, but it just, it smells like apples, and it smells like a clean apple scent. Like, if you were an apple that was just been washed, this is what you would smell like. By the way, I always unscrew the tops when I do these videos, because I learned that taking off the top, or like clicking the top, it's too loud in comparison to my voice. But yeah, this packaging is definitely Christmassy, but like I said, you can use this year round. Vanilla notes. But like I said, I'm focusing 
because it is perfumey, but it's like a lighter perfume. You could wear it day or night compared to like the other one we just did, um, the start of the night, which is more like an evening. But it, it just reminds me so much of summer, even though it's not a particularly summery scent. Just because it brings me back to like that time in my life. Um, I don't get too much of the strawberry, however, I do get a general berry note. Um, you definitely get the white amber and you definitely get the jasmine petals. Super, super good. I love these. Okay, so next up, we're going to move on to the body sprays. I have a lot of these. Uh, let's get through it. So, this one is Starlit Night, uh, which is the same as one of the body creams we just saw. Snowberry Midnight Iris Central Argument. But I think that's the, all the same notes as before. I spray inside the caps, so that way the caps just smell like them. Evening perfumey, like I said, it reminds me of like what you would wear to like a New Year's Eve party. Question of the day: What did you do for New Year's? Um, I was in bed by well, I was in bed by ten, and I probably went to sleep around eleven thirty. Did stay up. Gotta start the new year off right, well rested. Yeah, you definitely, you definitely get the midnight hours. And this, I love this set. Um, some Bath and Body Works stuff are like definitely more of a body spray, but this smells more. I wish there was like smell emission so you guys could smell this. It's like my favorite and I'm gonna be wearing this all the time. 
This is like 